Hello everyone and welcome back to Pozzolo. Thank you for being patient. So we're back here and the bridge apparently has been magically fixed. Oh, whenever that ends the story. Now um, we got all the gear and uh, supplies and some good chunk of cash for the next store hopefully. Um, I must say it's very fun to play with a full party. Assuming there isn't another party member. I guess there's technically enough room in the battle suite for one more portrait, so... But either way, uh, as it is, it's... Well, no, never mind. Blech. Play to what you think. Okay, never mind. This is Max Pie, then. <laughs> I was thinking... Blech. I don't know why I was thinking. Anyway. We need to kill Big Ape. Great Ape. Ape Ape. Ape Ape. Ape. But yeah, uh, big party. Very fun. And also, um, the new equipment for the main character and our little healing friend with the bow, um, she has a very nice item, it definitely, um, whole new bow lets her recover mana. Definitely keeping that until we find another item similar to that. Why, uh, the main character's new weapon actually gives him an HP regen effect. So those are both very nice. Hector Hamill. Well, I wonder who uses that. Let's see, two, one in defense. That's kind of odd, but he has high defense anyway. So also used by a knight in black armor. Got weird, but whatever. Hits nails among other things. Who's using a wacky hammer? Anyway, they ain't a bad find. Let's see, yeah. Also, I tried out uh, killing the little monkeys multiple. Like, you have a little, like common idea I always see is to, like in a battle where there's a monster that summons shit into battle. Kill the minion if you want like a whole bunch of experience from one battle. Kill the minions and then the master. But apparently the monkeys don't give you experience because I like I did a battle where I killed five of them before him and I still got like 20-ish experience for everyone. So there's apparently no real change there. I'm being careful, because if there's a boss, it's not going to hold, it's not going to be a pansy this time, that's for sure. The gather strategy works a lot better with more people, too. Also, our new friend is pretty useful, too. Uh, he may dance around like the soldiers, um, but... Um, contrary to his, what his staff says... Oh, interesting. The Hector Hamill has an additional attack. Uh, contrary to um, what his staff says, his staff actually makes a useful, powerful attacking weapon. And it's range, so it also adds a second force of range. Oh, uh, we need to kill this ape in one turn, or the poison's gonna take a huge chunk of his HP. See, that's, that's pretty. Aww. Oh. Didn't get him. Seriously. Yeah, 80 damage is pretty good. Stop killing everyone. Kill little monkeys. Throwing your fecal mantle everywhere. If I juggle when I win. Oh my god, let's go. Well, you got a whole bunch of grapes, too, because uh, now we got a whole bunch of people with decent amount of mana and spells and stuff, so. Just check it over there. Game likes to hide chests lately now. Ah! Man, he hates that freaking mage, I tell you. 
<laughs> well, interesting note that we the Weijin effects of uh, HP and mana keep cranking up. That's what I actually now that I think about it. It didn't list it. MP amount. Ooh. It didn't list the MP amount by the Hecto Hamel, so it only costs one gavel to use it. Hmm. So it looks like we're gonna start getting moves that need gavel, but not necessarily ma mana. That'll be nice. Stop getting into it. I mean, you're in the back for good sakes. Here we go, and back inside. More stuff being blocked. Of course, no monsters. Nope. These things again. We got more people this time. Go beat you up. Especially the visible up one up there. Hopefully, should be able to. Nope, didn't die. Still alive, and we can't see it now. We'll kill the toll since it's the next wet thing until we can see it again. Full force! 29 damage. Boo! Did the last bow do that much damage? Oh, one nimble. Yeah, we're gonna make really nice use of that bow. Hopefully there's an uh, upgrade version of it. You know what, cause but, but I, I think it's not like a horrible idea. But at the same time, oh, good lord, that thing likes to counter like hell. Good die. I mean, it's not the first time I've seen an RPG make use of, uh... One, uh... I should say, one item having a mana legion effect. I, I've seen RPGs that have done that before. Usually the idea is to just simply keep it and use it at your own discretion that you think you need to. Dude, crap. Stuff's still worth a lot more experience and heal. Unless they made it harder. I don't never even getting that much experience off those things, actually. Uh, I don't know. Excuse me, Krabby. I don't think we'll take that. I don't recall seeing anything. Maybe we'll come back to it later. Especially considering the last few slide things we took didn't really have anything useful. They were pretty much junk items you get out of the shop, so... I think we'll just come back to it later. Don't waste any time. Wasted a few minutes doing that last time, so we'll, we'll save a little time for the footage. Save that for a winding spot. No! Why does everyone want to attack him for good sakes? I know he's a mage and shit, but come on! Damn you, poison. Shit's pretty devastating. Oh crap. Turn back to normal. There we go. Damn, that thing counts like... Ah, oh, good lord.
we use a heal. Get poison off. We'll let some Norwegian effect take them. Okay. Pixelay shitty on! Oh, good lord. Seriously. The hell? Why didn't she use heal? That was weird. Hey, okay, this is getting ridiculous. No, well, maybe we should just run. Yeah, these things... These ain't the same difficulty as the previous ones. They're a lot harder. Oh, crap. Yeah, I think we should just run away. What the hell? Okay, yeah, we're running away. You see how much poison could just drastically affect the fight? Need a lot more inventory space. I have one more stack of orbs left and then I just have the grapes that I have. Hmm. It didn't look like there was anyone to go heal. Oh. That was a cliff. Potion. I guess we have to go down something. Tow. Tow. Less damage from water and ice. Well, we should know that's no hint. Let's give that two. Probably best to give it the hole. We'll give the dragon tooth to our main counter. Then keep our heal alive. So. See, that's weird. I've, I've noticed them randomly doing that lately. That takes us back down here. So maybe we do have to take that one now. now let's see then. If it doesn't waste our time. All getting lost. And Let's see. Oh, what's up with this one? Don't see hidden chests. That's the only place to go. Wall. Going up and down. I still haven't heard any new news about the Pasol we release of new copies, as. Uh, I haven't checked back with the site, though. 
That's something you have to keep track on your own, to be honest, if you're looking for a copy. Now, how about we just play? Save us a little ground. See what's the other way before we go down. Well, nothing, so it looks like we gotta go down. Yeah! Wish there was a little more variety. It always seems like you find the same two, three fights. Never really had that problem before bothering me much in an RPG. Just a bill hook? Who the hell is that supposed to be for? That's a big increase in attack. That gives our hero regen and it's only for him, so let's give it to you and up your attack anyway. Now where do we go here? Ah. Okay, that explains that, but then we'll... Where are we supposed to go from here then? So that was where we was. There don't appear to be anything over here. Yeah, go away. Go, deal. <laughs> Wow, nice. Then one away again. Everyone likes picking on the maid for good six. So yeah, there's nothing over here. So where the hell do we go now? This is just a complete dead end. Hmm. We can't go that way. Wait a minute. We can't go back the way we went. Now it just leads that way. So, oh! There we go. Thanks a lot, game, trying to trick me. Anyway, you know, I suppose I should start getting used to that. It's like, yep, it's a dead end, fall down, you get a chest. Ooh, we got a lot of chests everywhere, are you? Yeah, we're gonna try void heal. Hmm. Well, there was a chest over here, so let's go this way. Well, that ain't just the white way if we weren't chested. Oh, no town. Where are we? The Society of of the Lost Age. Splah! The Society is just fine. The two of us used to wool keel. They specialized in investigating particularly anything to do with the Lost Age. Like my dad? Oh, Lane, your father would kill to know what they know. <laughs> your father would kill to know what they know. Well, yeah, it looks like we're in the town, so it looks like now we're gonna do a little extra. Whoa. Greetings, travel. This is established by those who hunt within the mold. Let's go ahead and save. Let's uh, look around the city, and we'll probably do a cut here, and probably do a little more later. Oh, could go in that little blue there. A little odd. <laughs> oh. You just cave? 
Perhaps you met my cousin then. That reminds me, I should send him some coconuts. I'm so hungry, I could eat a... Roasted roaches? Ugh. Some things my mom and dad put on the dinner table are just disgusting. Since I'm weak, unnourished man with the disappointment, my wife is the worker in our family. Okay. Oh, that's out. Yeah. <coughs> the beds in here. How many times have you fought it in your life? What? The hell kind of question is that? You know it here, folks. <laughs> That's a new one to me in an RPG. <laughs> Living in stone houses is structurally necessary in this human environment. There has to be a story event here. It's obviously where we had to go. This is a strangely difficult looking puzzle. Sometimes it's worth the extra effort to use your strongest attacks against some beasts. Duh. What is this? I've been there for centuries it contains stones and powers that affect the human mind. I wonder what my husband will bring home for dinner today. Well, I hope it's better than what the other guy went. Roasted roaches. Yes, hubby, what do you bring? More roasted roaches! Isn't that good? <laughs> I want a divorce. You have roaches under your beds? That's nothing. We have roaches in our beds. Nope. It just goes round. Ugh, roaches in your bed. You know you need to uh, reconsider how you live in your house when you have roaches in your bed. I'm getting close to a hundred years old and yeah, I'm proud to say I almost fully take care of myself. Oh, uh, good for you. No wrong with that. A chest. Believe that was I am a cure to sleep and poison. You want to hear what I know of the secret society? Maybe, but apparently you didn't want to share it. No. Okay, here goes. Force. They are all located in the village. Second, their business is extremely secret, hence the name. There is no sword. Get the fuck out of the building so I can get in it. Never program people to randomly walk into doorways. McGlove Wad? Twenty-five chance twenty-five percent chance to cause poison. Freezes attack and the lowers it's magic attack though. Let's try it though. If it don't look like it's much good, we can always get rid of it. Ooh, pardon me. I want to heal. What is this? Plus 64? Programmed houses with no one or anything inside? Dynamite. Let's blow up a hole. There we go. Fire's a key. 
Assuming that's the secret society. They're very hidden. Well, we need a key. Key, a key, a key. We need a key. Well, look, we skipped a whole bunch of crap. Ain't good. Ouch, if there's one piece of advice I have for you youngsters, is this. Take good care of your body. Welcome, our goods come directly from the mangrove. Here's average. Ooh, damn, potions are pretty expensive. Berries. Small. Yeah, but we're gonna want to stop moving those because Horbs ain't really cutting it. Well, berries. I see you traveling warriors. I see you are traveling warriors and need a powerful weapons. An old geezer like me has no use for this knife anymore, except for chopping vegetables, maybe. I will give this knife to you. If you count. All engraved faces in the village and tell me the correct number. If you fail, I will continue to chop vegetables until I die. Or until some warriors with basic math skills accept this challenge. The moment the truth... Ew. Pressing me right now? Well, that was a lucky guess. Oh, the master key. This isn't a knife, it's a key! Yes, but you will get a knife if you find a chest the key belongs to. Oh. Trying to screw with us, huh? <laughs> it's like, yeah, if you go get the... <laughs> the nice little, uh... Yeah, this place is starting to turn into a maze. It's starting to remind me of that one PS2 RPG that used to, that was originally a Dreamcast game. Hmm. Probably better off to go out the other one explore the Oh dear. We got a lot of stuff to cover around here. Secret Society? I think they cut their hair to get rid of lice. Yeah, it's okay. Alright, I gotta take the long way. Being over 80, I have nothing to live for these days. Well, that was absolutely worth the time. Why don't you just tell me how your life has been... I once snuck into the headquarters of the secret society. After they caught me, they cut my dad's salary. <laughs> we have something we need to do. Why don't you three look around and we'll find you in a few hours. Um, okay. Catch you on the flip, kids. Catch you on the flip. Just trying to relate to the uh, kitties. Speak the lingo, you know. How did we ever end up walking together? Oh, now I have to go without them? Oh, that kind of sucks, but, uh. Hmm. Well, let's go find out. Why do I the inevitable? There was once a man who tried to fool us. That man is dead now. We commend your efforts and punish your failure. Talk to Shisha. We commend your efforts and punish your failures. <laughs> Ha 
State your business. The sun rises upon the harbor and the world begins anew. Just a moment. Damn, you still remember that? He's waiting to see you. Buy my beard, Woody. Ahem. <clears throat> um. Right, of course. Tea? We'll pass. It seems this isn't a coursey visit. What brings you here? We have some children with us. They have something you need to see. Nothing children could obtain would be of any interest to the society. I respectfully disagree. In fact, I believe the society's mandate requires you to examine what these children have found. You always wore a march in the genesis. <laughs> you, you do have me intrigued, though. Very well. Bring me to them. Better not be disappointed. Bring them to me. I better. Wait. I gotta go get them now? Why the... Why the music just cut out? Oh, there we go. Well then, kids! You get to meet the head honcho! So what do they know about the Lost Age? More than you can imagine, but lately, they've been particularly interested in the legend of the architects. You think this compass has something to do with it? They'll have s they'll have something interesting to say, I'm sure. You're not telling us something. Sharp kid, no. They will rumors of Grandma had discovered more of the legends of the and they were conducting well something to prove it. They will forward to it as the bridge. Who knows how literal that could be taken though. Of course, it's unlikely they ever managed to finish it, considering they were all well. Anyway, I don't think you could concern yourselves with it. Let's all take a rest and get away for the meeting tomorrow. I'll go out for a drink. See you guys later. See ya. Go ahead and rest, kids. I'll be awake for a while. Hmm. Anyone getting an ominous feeling here? How are you doing? Enjoying the time alone? You remember my name this time. Of course, of course. Memory's not so good lately. Sure, what can I do for you? I must confess something. Okay. We've been following you both for some time now. Not spying, poor C. But every now and then we check up on you. That doesn't surprise me. Yes, well, this might. There are anomalies in Woody's travels, times and places we can't verify. His sickness as well. Doesn't it strike you how volatile the disease was? Woody's not a weak man. Whatever he caught wasn't found in Wujin. If you're accusing Woody of... Woody's value to the society is unquestionable and no are being made. I am merely suggesting that whatever you two have found be secured by us as quickly as possible. Good night. Good night, my friend. So how was your drink? Important. Don't look good. Welcome, everyone. I trust your nights were restful. We've been informed that our guests have discovered something of importance to this society. Normally, we would be skeptical of such claims, but the two adults sitting before us are no strangers to our group. Before we begin, I must say what I hope is obvious. What is discussed in these walls is to remain here. No exceptions. 
If you're a society of intellects, why keep your discoveries secret? Some things are better known than said, my child. Now please hand over the item. That was not part of the agreement. For me to inspect would be still so quick to judge. Go ahead. My, my, the craftsmanship is incredible. Have you been able to use it? No, we're not even sure what it is for. I see. I saw you were discovering that it's not a typical compass. We figured that out, yes. We may have something that is of use. Know that if you are to assist you in any information you will acquire will belong to us as well. Of course. Look at him. He's practically licking his lips. Bring it here, please. You got... You just got... Little book. This book has been useful to us in the past. If the object has anything to do with the Lost Age, then its secrets may be found in this manuscript. How you use it, of course, is up to you. We look forward to your findings. Yes, of course. This being is missed. You may go. Alright, kids. Let's get back to the inn and try to figure this out. Help decipher the compass's message. Can't use it. Okay, so go back to then, so let's hoof it. Uh, looks like we have to really hoof it. I don't think we even found the end. Uh, no, yeah, we didn't we, we didn't even find it yet, so So we gotta still find the inn and finish exploring too. Got lots of old buildings here. See, this is back in heel. But as you know, you don't need to fight pork. Uh, thanks for the not very useful information. Eh, yeah, that looks like the end now. Can you imagine? I've lived within these village walls my entire life. I've just it a few times during the winters and hunted a little out in the mad groove, but that's about it. If there, are, if, they, <clears throat> if there are instructions, I can't find them. They must be encoded. That's a shock! I'll let you walk on it while I go catch something to eat. Yeah, good idea. I'm going with you. Oh boy, this is hard. This thing's a thick enough to beat goats to death with. <laughs> How are we going to decode it? <laughs> There doesn't seem to be any real link between the book and the compass. Is Sasha mad? Or does he know something we don't? I don't know. I don't think they've wasted waste our time. They want whatever secrets this compass holds as badly as we do. It's an ancient language, but there are words here that they just don't look right. What do you mean? Well, I think they're misspelled, but... How could someone be small enough to contract a book this side and spell words? Because it wasn't an accident? Of course! What 13? Come again? An old method of encoding something. Take each row and move it 13 rows ahead. And... Jackpot! Nice job! So, we have three words. Point, zero, and north. Point zero is to the north. What's point zero? Sounds like it's pointing us to the Mahone Mountains. 
Who knows? But we should inform Shisha. Absolutely not. What? Why? Well, you say it yourself. He's not to be trusted. Let him assume we're still at a loss. At least until we figure out what this is. Are you okay? I'm fine. Do you have a map? We have the book, don't we? Or a tad more complicated than that. I have maps of the area with me. We should be fine. We should speak... Going back the way we came will waste time. I'm sure he has alternative means of getting now. Sweet, some kind of trance portal? No, nothing quite that elaborated. Hmm. I think the game's trying to make us a little suspicious. Also, did that West count as... Yes, it did. It healed everyone, so we don't really need to actually West at the end. That's good. My crazy grandpa wants to get rid of his stuff before he dies amongst witches, his treasured knife. Okay. Now we need to find how to get over to that stuff. So we need to... Oh, well, yeah, we might as well just deal with it, because we gotta go backwards anyway, I get it. Well, I'm not really sure. Hmm. Actually, I'm not really sure where the way to go forward after the village is anyway. Unless it's behind that locked door. Oh well, either way, we'll find out here. Might as well just go report. What town of fields. What brings you back? The team tells us about the next destination. You wish to use the passage? No way we wouldn't ask, but we have no business. Of course, and the sooner you finish, the sooner we can investigate this compass. In the book, was it of no help? It might be yet, but for now we're stumped. Is that the case? What? Of course it is. Very well. I'll open the passage for you. Be safe on your journey and be quick. We look forward to your reports. Thank you. Take this with you. You will need to activate the passage. Small key. Uh oh. We get a... They're, they're probably gonna go like, I don't trust them. Something's up. Ugh. I want them followed. Of course, they'll trust us. Oh, deal. Yeah, I think the Kyoto's are all getting into something that's a little bigger than everyone. And everyone wants a cut of it. Okay. So we can unlock that one door, which apparently moves us forward. But we need to get that one chest. I believe if we go back this way. Oh, pardon me. And that's where the locked door was. I believe there was a small area to the left we didn't get to look at. Yeah. To get to the west part of the village, you need to go through the underground passage through the two houses. And to get to the chest, you need to go up the stairs and find a tall vest. Wasn't that the previous armor thing? No. Oh yeah, that was one of the things I found inside there. Yeah. Let's see. Well, you could use it. But then again... Hmm. See, I'm still very iffy whether we're gonna keep these kills. <laughs> I'm being actually... I'm starting to fall for the game's suspicion with his father. Let's give it to the main killer, though, for now. Until we get a little more trusting that we're gonna actually keep killing those here. Okay, and I think that's everything fully explored. No, apparently it was no actual shop. When have we built it, right? No item shop. Hmm. That's a bit of a shame. So should we buy a whole bunch of potions then? Hmm. 
Then we probably want to grind a little because the monsters ahead are probably going to be kind of the thing to kick our ass with. So let's just take a little peek. Open the door. Let's go ahead and save too. Let's take a small peek at what we're expecting here. More the same music. Dang. There's one tall ass man, that's for sure. So let's see if we got any new enemies we're gonna be uh, being attacked by. Nope. The same thing, still. They obviously were giving more experience, so yeah. We're gonna go ahead and think wide a little more. Uh, probably buy a whole bunch of potions, actually. So, uh, yeah, we're not exactly to an hour, but probably don't really have much time for any more major events, so we'll go ahead and cut this at the current time. See you on the next episode.